to extract part of a longer string, use the sub STR command, which is the ultimate flex by the developers because sub STR is a substring of the word substring. It takes three arguments the string that you want to interrogate. This can be a literal, a bind variable, database column, expression, or even a clob. The second argument is where to start, and the third argument is how many characters to extract. Substring 1, 5 will get five characters starting from position 1. Substring 7, 5 will get five characters starting from position 7. If the third argument is too large, you will extract to the end of the passed in string. If the first argument is 0, it will be treated as 1. If the third argument is omitted, you will extract once again to the end of the string. The second argument can be negative. In this case, we will start from the end of the string and count backwards, similar to a write function. If the second argument starts from a position greater than the length of the string, we will return null. Any non-integer values will be truncated, so substring 1.3 is the same as 1, and substring 1.8 is not rounded up, it will also be treated as 1 for a starting position. Tragically, the substring function in dbmslob has its arguments reversed. The second parameter is the number of characters you want to extract, and the third parameter is where to start.